Kama Joba. Now this is hello in Georgian. And why am I speaking Georgian? Because I'm in Tbilisi. Behind me here is the new Olympic Sports Palace. This was constructed in 2015 to mark Georgia's return to active youth sports. And it's hosted a number of events since then till now. It'll be the host venue for the 2017 Junior Eurovision Song Contest. We'll be welcoming people on November 26th, on leading up of course rehearsals, for Junior Eurovision. Now shine bright like a diamond and come with me as we go inside to see the two main halls that will be playing host to this year's activities. And what I love so much about the Olympic Palace of Sports is that it's pretty much dedicated to youth in sports. So from sports like indoor football, to volleyball, to basketball, to boxing, and even wrestling, it just features an array of activities involving children and children only. For the first time, this will play host to music events, Junior Eurovision Song Contest, shining bright with 3,800 spectators coming in through these doors, right through here, and walking, walking, walking into the main belly of activity. Come with me. Two floors up from where the activity is downstairs, you've got the press center. This is where members of the press and Eurovision journalists will all gather and team up. A bit of bonding, a bit of socializing, and of course, a lot of work. This will open from 9 a.m. in the morning right until 10 p.m. at night. It's gonna be a long day of just covering activity, rehearsals, interviews, and of course, Junior Eurovision. Let's go inside and check out where many of the interviews will be taking place at Junior Eurovision. Dara Tun will be ready to have fun in a room this big. My God, lots of questions to ask the artist and the acts performing. Force from Netherlands, pack all four in. It'll be very easy. The media rooms here in, at the Olympic Sports Palace in Tbilisi are just so huge, so big. These acts are gonna shine bright. <laughs> Guess what guys? Isabella Clark will be speaking up at her press conference. Now, press conferences for Junior Eurovision Song Contest will be in this room. 16 countries from all over Europe and Australia will be taking turns on that table. There'll be a big screen behind them showing the graphic and their country. And of course, all the press and the media teams will be right there taking their spots. Paparazzi's trying to get the best photos. And of course, Wee Wee Blogs will be here to bring you all the latest news with attitude. And there you have it, the Olympic Palace of Sports. We are here in the epicenter of where Junior Eurovision will take place. As I mentioned earlier, there'll be 3,800 bums on seats all over here and the main atrium will be the stage where Georgia will be welcoming junior acts from all over Europe singing their tunes. Now who's your favorite so far? Who are you most excited to see on stage? How do you think the venue will translate from sports to music? And will you be in Georgia most importantly? Let us know your comments on Wimu Blogs. Enjoy. See you later. Bye.